Hello, 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 and welcome back. I hope you're all well. I'm going to keep this video short and sweet. Basically, I've been playing Worms properly for like the past two or three days, just kind of analysing it, like looking over it properly. Um, and I've noticed the game has a lot of potential, like it has it in abundance. But there's things that need to be improved on, and there's things that are missing from the game that will can, that can hinder it if it's not addressed early, you know? For example, look at a game called Lawbreakers. That game had so much potential, but it died because of a lack of content. But I'll get into that in a minute. Before I start to talk about what I feel needs to be included in the game to increase replayability, let's address the elephant in the room, and that is the Hammerhead. I feel that it's the only weapon in the game that really needs like a bit of a workaround, a bit of a tweak. Nothing major, but there's just a little, there's little things about it. And don't get me wrong, like, I don't have an issue. When people use hammerheads, I can still get around and kill them because there is always a way. But for the game to be friendly to new players, especially since it's a PS Plus game, you're going to get a wide variety of skill levels. Um, that hammerhead needs to be nerfed or at least to have a require a bit more skill. And there's many solutions to this. I could think of three, one of which being increase the amount of solve damage you can do with the hammerhead. The thing is, people need to be scared of using the hammerhead in bad situations because they don't want to damage themselves. But at the minute, because you don't take as much damage, people will just run up in your face and just let off all the rockets. And it's just, it takes away the skill from the game. Like, what's the point using a shotgun if you have a hammerhead? So, the other two solutions are of a similar nature. So, one of them would be to decrease the max ammo you can have for the hammerhead. So, instead of having eight rockets, like, limit down to four. Or something I just thought of right now, you could have, like, um, a special ammo type for it that you can't pick up any more ammo of or it's rare that makes it fair because you can keep the part make the weapon powerful but you can't everyone just can't have it and then the other vet the other solution would be to decrease the spawn rate of the hammerhead especially in battle royale just because by the end of the game it's just a hammerhead fight like what's the point that being said though i do have faith that team 17 would do something about it because of how they responded to the sentry gun my only issue, my only worry is that they, I don't want them to nerf the um, hammerhead too much to the point where people won't use it. Because it's, it's manageable now. It's just not good for new players, you know. And this brings me on to my final point, which I feel is the most important point, And that's replayability and content of the game. Don't get me wrong, I feel like the game is really fun. And I'm having a blast with it. But I can't see right now what will keep people that have maxed out the characters engaged. And the thing is, you could say, oh, people just play the game a little bit less, blah, blah, blah. But at this point, if people have already maxed out the character within a month of the game coming out. So eventually, I say about three months, people are going to hit level 50. Everyone's going to be level 50. But then what will be there to keep people playing? And I propose that needs to be uh, a ranked mode. Because the formula of the game already like, already encourages it. So I didn't, it could add a couple more gamers, probably a team-based one. Or if they want to keep it like free-for-all-ish, like, like deathmatch, like King of the Hill game modes or something like that. Keep it interested. You put a ranking system from like bronze up to let's say diamond or some weird worms versions of it like holy or something i don't know something cool you know and then in each rank at the end of the season you could get like a cosmetic that you can only get per season similar to like what uncharted did so you could get like a hat that you only could get in season three of if you were gold in season three and that should keep people playing because even still even if people don't, aren't engaged in the game that much anymore People will come on it to make sure they don't miss out on the loot that they could get from placing in a certain rank every season. Uh, I think that is crucial to keeping the game alive because so far I've got no other gripes. The game is amazing. If you have any suggestions, let me know what you think. I'm happy to hear them. Let me know in the comments and goodbye.